some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in St. Louis, Missouri, with the frauditor known as Central Tyrant Investigations, as, uh, well, he uh, believes himself to be more educated than the people in the courthouse and, uh, well, fails at educating them, and he ends up getting booted out. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. All right, guys, we have here is the, it looks like the courthouse. Um, I'm going to try to go in there, you know, and uh, try to conduct some service, but you know how they're going to be. They're going to tell me that I can't be in there just because of the color of my skin and probably the hat I'm wearing. This is such a crock of shit. Must you pull out the race card before this thing even begins? I mean, you haven't even walked up to the door yet, and already you're implying that there are nothing but a bunch of racists in there. Oh, for shame, dude. Really, for shame. Let's go see, guys. All right, guys, I think we passed the uh, court. There's a lot of officers inside of here, so I think we want to go in there and uh, see if they're educated or not. We can definitely, uh, so, so we definitely can go inside of here. Did you ever notice that the majority of frauditors uh, wish to educate people on, uh, well, their misinterpretation of laws and the Constitution? Well, uh, I, yeah, I've noticed it too quite often. Uh, it comes from the fact that most of these guys are uh, poorly educated, barely made it through elementary school, and probably didn't graduate high school at all. And therefore, well, uh, have fallen through the cracks of uh, our uh, education system overall. So they wind up suffering from the Dunning-Kruger effect, where they believe that a little bit of knowledge that they gain from anything makes them experts in the field of everything. It says uh, no photography, videography, recording of any kind is permitted in the courthouse. But that's not how that works. It's actually inside of the courtroom. So if you do want to record, you're allowed to record if you're not inside of the courtrooms, which is what I'm understanding. So I think we should be able to go in here and check out this uh, this uh, little facility here. And there's a guy coming over here trying to tell me that I can't be here and do what I'm doing. You know, speaking of their poor quality of education, the uh, majority of these frauditors don't even bother to look up the... Uh, rules and regulations for the courts in their own state. But, you know, uh, if they actually go on these websites, they'll find that uh, the judge can make regulations on the uh, use of recording equipment within the uh, courthouse itself. And as long as it's not a blanket ruling where they uh, ban everything, then they, uh, they'll they be fine. But it's understandable these frauditors don't even bother to... Uh, do proper research. I mean, they barely graduated second grade. Yeah, yeah. How rude was that to interrupt my video here? Sir, yeah. By order of the court, you're not allowed to video inside this building. So it's in the court rooms, right? In this building. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I was just reading because I was looking at your training there. He said, he said inside the court rooms. So that's why I was like, oh, I can come in here and record court building yes sir okay so that's the entire thing not even in the public lobby here yes sir okay is there like a chief judge's order against that i was just wondering no it's made by people uh, much smarter than you who understand that protection of jurors and uh everything like that is essential to uh well having a fair judicial system i mean you can't just walk in here and uh well uh, accidentally film a uh juror or uh get uh, wind on a uh, piece of uh, privileged attorney-client information, I mean, that would be, well, a security breach right there. And we can't have that now, can we? So you got to right step here. outside because right now, you're yeah. about, you see that sign I'm saying? Yeah, so I just looked at your training video That's there, fine. and he but said... you can't have this recording right here. You're like... Oh, you right want me to step back a foot? Yeah. There we go, there you we go. That? And let this door go. Yeah, yeah. Because you're not supposed to be in here with it. Well, I was you're just, just looking at your... Sign. Yeah, I was just looking at your training but video. But you're recording. Ma'am, can, 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 I, can I speak? Sir, step, step out there and then we can speak, but... Like, I'm out here. Okay, step out and let the door close. 
Oh, I was just trying you to get You are the... recording inside of the courthouse right inside. now. Yeah, so he said, time. the guy here on the video said, no recording inside the courtroom. So that's why I was like. The sign here, you read the sign up front there. Yeah, so I was, trying to, I was trying to get the chief judge's order that says that. Did you guys have a copy of that? You know, for auditor, given your uh, less than second grade education, I highly doubt that uh, you would be even able to uh, read the judge's order, much less understand it. I mean, you frauditors tend to have a bad habit of, uh, well, reading only one par part of a paragraph and thinking that, well, I don't need to read the rest of it uh, for me to uh, enter this place. I mean, it says right here, uh, for news uh, purposes, and I don't need to go further than that, am I right? That's how you uh, idiots generally operate. You don't bother to read the rest of the paragraph. I'm just, it's a serious question. I was just asking if I could get a chief judge's order. You can contact the courts. Okay, who would I talk to about that? Google the number. I don't know the number I'll talk about. You guys won't give me that information? I don't have the information for you. Oh, okay. So uh, you don't have a chief okay, so judge. So you're blocking the doorway. We're going to ask you to step outside. So when you block something, that means you're preventing somebody from getting in here, which I'm not doing because there's nobody here. So I can't get a chief you're judge's order. I'm blocking the door blocking or the doorway. You're blocking the door. I don't think you understand how that works. Oh, listen to this smarty pants frauditor as he tries to educate the uh, guard on uh, blocking a doorway when clearly, clearly he has. No idea uh, himself. I mean, yeah, he can be impeding traffic without anybody being there. I mean, you're blocking the door, moron, and you never know at any second. Somebody may want to go through that door, and, uh, well, you never know what kind of attitude they'll have with you. And uh, with that smart mouth of yours, you're liable to get the smackdown of your life. So I can record right here, right? You can't record inside the courthouse. What's your order? Like this door right here. Y'all said I could step back here and record, so. All right, guys. Well, this video right here says no record inside the courtrooms. And uh, sorry for that. There, that. That fine gentleman there said no record inside the courtrooms. He didn't say anything about recording inside this little, uh, this little lobby here. So, yeah, we got a whole bunch of tyrants inside of here. You guys know that, so. I guess they're not going to let us record inside of here at all. All these guys came over to me, and that lady came over to me. They wouldn't help me at all, which is, uh, you know, I'm kind of upset about that. But Oh, poor baby. Oh, you're upset about it. Do you want the cops to come along and uh, enforce your feelings, little fauditor? Oh, yeah, and I'm sure you want to go home and uh, have your mama bake you some warm um, chocolate chip cookies and, and pour you a nice, uh, tall glass of, uh, milk to wash it down with. And after all that, she can change your diaper and apply some of Black Heart Knight's butthurt cream, guaranteed to cure any pain in your ass or your money back. Actually, it's free, and the elves say it'll cure any pain in your ass, but I don't really don't believe those tyrants. Damn dirty elves always looking to make a profit off my butthurt cream. You know, we're not going to push it too further because I ain't trying to spend my day in, in, in jail at all. So, all right, guys, let's keep on walking around. I guess we got to record outside here. <laughs> they, look, they wouldn't let me record inside that courthouse. I'm just distraught, guys. They had their cameras on the whole time and they wouldn't let me record. <laughs> How y'all doing? rodeos in there if y'all were wondering yeah well guess guys i guess we're just gonna have to take the loss here you know i don't want to go to jail like i keep saying because it's a beautiful day out here and i just hate that my rights get violated everywhere i go well anyways let's just go on to the next place let's get happy boys because it's still a long day let's go you suck i pledge allegiance to the flag of the united states of america and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Maybe these people need to come out here and join me. You know, as we say, our national anthem, that, that's something that, that, you know, they can't go against. Even though they don't like it, they can't go against it. So hats off to that one. Let's keep going around here and uh, enjoying this beautiful day out here. There's people wondering what the heck I'm doing, but I'm just trying to find the local rodeo. You know, there's a lot of bulls out there. 
that I can't seem to find. I found one bull and one bullshitter, so <laughs> let's keep going. Yeah, I'd say there was a bullshitter in there, and it certainly wasn't anybody other than you, my friend. I mean, you ever hear of the uh, old saying, money talks, bullshit walks? Well, if you take away the money and add in uh, common sense, yeah, then uh, we could apply it to this. And common sense talks and bullshit walks and you are certainly walking away from this with the walk of shame dude congratulations dude you are a freaking idiot this could be some groundbreaking stuff right here you don't want to go to jail for what you read this yeah. i don't have to listen to read anything it. blah 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 i'm not listening gosh i'm not Blah 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fucking leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. What's the Third Amendment? Most definitely, because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera. Doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. That sort of thing. Well, this is what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead, uh, per the, um, the, uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so with that said, um, I've got too many entities I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. Do you want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. He chose poorly. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. Also. So that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the supposed speed limit. Um, no, I didn't talk it, about yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, but I said... That's a 25. 25. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. Hi, how are you? Okay, I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave, okay? Yeah, Why? I've been calling after you. You know you're not to be on campus. No. Put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys... You are now under arrest. You guys were arresting me for nothing. No. You know you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. <laughs> Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want what, someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity.